one of the fundamental rules of golf is to play the ball as it lies. And sometimes those lies can be brutal. Thick rough, wet sand. We're gonna put those brutal lies to the test. We wanna determine once and for all, what is golf's worst lie? To find out, we've called on a pro with one of the best short games in golf. PGA professional, Brad Faxon. With 19 wins worldwide, including eight on the PGA Tour, Faxon's been one of the game's best for over 15 years. So what's Brad's technique for getting his ball out of nasty situations? Like this thick rough. For the worst lies, most players on the PGA Tour use a sand wedge with a lot of loft. 60 degrees is the most loft I use. My stance is open to the target line. On shots like this out of the thick rough, the club head actually never comes in contact with the ball. It goes underneath the ball, through the heavy rough, and pops the ball up into the air. Our Phantom High Speed Camera confirms that his club never comes in contact with the ball. It simply pushes the grass, which in turn sends the ball up in the air. These principles apply whether Brad is hitting out of thick rough or fried egg lies in sand. In fact, even when hitting out of water, there's an inch of water between the club face and the ball. When you go out to practice, do you find the worst spot possible? We go for the worst stuff. We try and recreate anything. You can't find a lie that I haven't seen. All right, Brad, that sounds like a challenge. We're going to find a lie you can't possibly get your ball 